From the station working for you, this is an RTV6 update. Hello, I'm Lauren Casey, and these are the headlines from your RTV6 newsroom. New from overnight, Indiana first responders are loading up gear and heading out as they've been called in to help with Hurricane Florence as it takes aim at the East Coast. More than 80 team members of the Indiana Task Force One team are on their way to Raleigh, North Carolina. That's where they will stage for further assignments from FEMA to help with any needs related to the hurricane. That can make you a little nervous riding a storm out. Um, it rattles and bangs around a little bit, but uh, you know we, we're a little used to it and uh, we typically don't uh, don't put people in harm's way, even our own people. If we're going to be uh, finding protection there for the storm, then they'll put us in a secure structure where we can do that. Indiana Task Force One can help with things like water rescues, search and rescue efforting, and building collapse investigations. Let's get a check of our forecast with Todd Clausen. All right, finally the sunshine working its way back into the forecast throughout the day today. And with that sunshine, we'll see temperatures eventually climb up into the low to mid 70s across the area. So it's a very nice afternoon. It's a nice evening for us as well. And here's even the better news as we look at rain chances going forward the next few days. Essentially no rain chances Wednesday, Thursday or Friday. It's probably not until Sunday actually that we bring some rain back into the forecast. So finally, after a very, very wet weekend, a nice opportunity to dry out here over the next couple days. Lauren. Todd, thank you. For more stories and weather you need to know, you can download the RTV6 mobile app. Thanks for joining us.